Hello students, welcome to my channel. I hope you all are fine. So today our topic is free radical substitution reaction. First of all, I will tell you the basic reaction, then I will go through the mechanism. So stay with me and let's get started. What is free radical substitution reaction? Now free radical is any element that has unpaired electron in its outermost shell and what is substitution now the example of substitution reaction is given here that is a is bonded with b plus c and after reacting the b is replaced with the compound c and you can see here that a c is the product now this is what we call substitution reaction. It is also called single displacement reaction because only single compound is displaced here. Example of free radical substitution reaction is the halogenation of alkenes. Uh, here you can see that this is an alkene molecule and this is a halogen molecule. And after reacting, the hydrogen is replaced with the halogen group producing HCl. This is called halogenation of alkene. Now let's go through the reaction steps. Free radical substitution reaction include three basic steps. Initiation, propagation and termination. The first step is initiation. It means to start or to begin. In this step, the halogen molecule breaks down in the presence of sunlight or UV radiation to free radicals. One electron moves towards this side and one electron moves towards this side and form two chloride radicals. These chloride radicals now propagate through other chain reactions. This chloride free radical will substitute this alkene How? This bond will break down, one electron will move towards carbon atom and one electron will bond with the chloride radical like this and forms HCl plus C H second H third H and free radical because here you can see the unpaired electron is moving towards the carbon atom in this step this is the free radical now propagation means the chain reaction that continues until all the hydrogen is substituted with the halogen so i will show the two steps here now here this is the free radical and this free radical will continue the chain this free radical plus now another halogen molecule will react with this radical like this this unpaired electron will shift here and this unpaired electron will shift here and make a bond with this carbon c cl bond will form and another unpaired electron will move towards the halogen and forming an unpaired electron. So Cl1 free radical plus CH, CH, CH and H is replaced with the halogen group. Okay, so that's why it is called a propagation step because it is a chain reaction step. It is a chain reaction in which the reaction continues until all the product is substituted. Now the last one is the termination step in which two free radicals having unpaired electrons bond together and form paired electron to terminate the reaction, to stop the reaction. Now these radicals will also bond with each other 
and forms ethane now the last one is cl free radical plus alkyl free radical and forms halogenated alkene that in this initiation step the halogen molecule is broken down into free radicals this free radical took hydrogen with it and forms the alkyl free radical this alkyl radical then combines with the halogen molecule to form substituted alkene and produces the free radical in the termination step you can see that unpaired electrons paired up and stops the reaction no more radicals no more chain reactions same here and same here these steps will terminate the reaction